In this video, we show you how to operate and achieve the best results with your Bowers micro gauge. The ingenious two point micro gauge was designed specifically for the accurate measurement of bores from 1 to 6 millimeters. The micro gauge sets are supplied in a fitted wooden case. All setting rings are supplied with UCAS certification as standard. To switch the micro gauge on, simply press Set. The micro gauge allows two independent reference values to be set Ref 1 and Ref 2. By pressing Mode until Ref appears and then pressing Set, either Ref 1 or Ref 2 can be selected as required. A preset value can now be entered into either of the unit's memories. It is recommended that the micro gauge be set using the supplied setting master ring. Select Preset Mode by pressing Mode until Pre is displayed, and then press Set. At this stage, it's important to ensure that the value is entered as a positive value. Press Set to ensure a plus sign is displayed. Then press Mode to move the cursor along, press Set to change the digits. You may now enter the value from the relevant setting ring. When the desired value has been entered, press and hold mode to store this preset value. You can check the preset value is stored correctly by pressing set. To calibrate the micro gauge, first press mode until dia is displayed. Then press set to switch diameter mode on. Confirm by pressing Mode. You will then see the diameter symbol is displayed on the left of the display. Carefully insert the micro gauge into the master setting ring and sweep the measuring head past the center of the bore. This can be repeated by pressing Set each time to ensure a consistent reading. Remove the micro gauge from the master setting ring and press Mode until Cal is displayed. Then press Set to calibrate and Set again. The micro gauge is now ready to measure your component. Carefully insert the micro gauge into the bore and sweep the measuring head past the center of the bore to measure the bore size. This process can be repeated by pressing Set. It's important to note that when measuring horizontally, the contacts of the split ball head must be vertical. It is possible to change the measuring value to either millimeter or inches by pressing Mode until Unit is displayed. Then press Set to change to the desired measuring unit and Mode to store. The selected measuring unit is shown in the bottom left hand corner of the display. Another feature of the micro gauge is its switchable 0.0005.01 or 0.001 mm resolution or the inch equivalent. This can be achieved by pressing Mode until Res is displayed, and then pressing Set until the desired value is reached. Press Mode to select the desired resolution. To clear any set values from the micro gauge, Press and hold Mode and Set together until Clear is displayed. Any previously set parameters are now cleared. Measuring data from the micro gauge can quickly and easily be transmitted either by optional RS-232 or USB output. Data is sent to the PC by pressing the Set button when in diameter mode. The supplied depth stop can be screwed onto the micro gauge to enable measurement at a consistent depth and can also aid the squaring of the unit to the component. The micro gauge sets include multiple interchangeable probes. Within a standard set, the same cone can be used for each probe. To change the probe, unscrew the existing probe, remove the cone, and place in the new probe. Screw the probe onto the micro gauge and tighten with the adjusting key. The probe should then be calibrated with the relevant master setting ring. To put the micro gauge into standby mode,
Press set until the display goes blank. To turn the micro gauge off completely, simply press and hold the set button for approximately 3 seconds until off is displayed. For more information about the micro gauge or any other products in the Bowers range, visit www.bowersmetrology.com.